Hey guys, I'm back with another video, and uh, I just want to show you guys a little cool uh, thing I did, I guess. Uh, I was playing Bemidji Drive, and I was drifting, you know, D27, and uh, all that stuff. And, uh, you know, I used this as the A-brake, so I just pressed that, and, you know, to start drifting and all that. So I'm getting into drifting on Bemidji Drive. I'm getting pretty good, actually. Not to be uh, bragging or anything. Anyway, so I wanted to have an actual, like, E-brake stick, okay? Like that. <laughs> and, uh... I just kind of thought of, uh, I had an Xbox One controller just laying around. Zip tied it, there's like screws everywhere, it's, uh, yeah. Um, it's down pretty well. Then I put a screw in this little thing that I just found, I could have got something better, but I just had this lying around. And I, at first, I was going to have it so press that button, that trigger. But I kind of put it in the wrong, so it's already pressing that all the time. But it presses the trigger, that trigger. So I tried that out, and actually in BMNG, um, if you set that for the e-brake, it'll lock it up more the more you pull it. So the more I pull it, the easier it is to lock up the tires, which is really more realistic. So I pull just a little bit, it'll slow them down a little bit. I pull a little bit more, kind of like, and then if I pull like more, then will just lock them up 100%. So it's actually really cool. I like it, but uh, otherwise, yeah. Otherwise, uh, you can just uh, set it up for a button or uh, anything like that. But uh, yeah, so I'm gonna do a little bit of driving uh, with my G27. I actually have a really uh, some good techniques. I've been uh, doing this for a little while. Pretty much put it in half speed, so two times slow motion, and that's the easiest. It's way easier than normal speed, and like four times slow motion is sometimes a little bit too slow. I'm um, gonna have uh, this car is actually a mod. It's a 200 SX or 240 SX. Um, it's kind of the 200BX, but more options for it, and I have like the big lock steering, um, welded diff, twin turbo, inline six, aka the 2JZ. Anyway, so, uh, I'm gonna show you guys, uh, oh, oh. Pull it, and it locks it up, and then I let go, and, okay, that's really hard to tell. I'm gonna try to set this up a little bit better. Alright, let's do side view like that. Get a second gear, it probably makes like 500 horsepower right now. Alright. So I'll get some speed going, and then pull it, and it locks right up, and then I let go, and it, it keeps going. So, uh, yeah. One thing I've noticed, though, is kind of, uh, like, BMW's drive since there's one controller at a time, since there's two. Um, when I pull it, it kind of, the gas keeps going, but it's almost like I'm pressing the clutch, so I have to kind of just quick tap the clutch. To get it going, and it was actually kind of cool because it kind of like you know just um, kicking, kicking the uh, kicking the clutch. What am I saying? Yeah, it's just kind of cool. Um, but it works really well. I like it. Also, one more thing. I just bought this. There we go. Fallout 4 pre-ordered it. I'm gonna pre-download it. And Tuesday, hopefully, Fox did the game or might have some videos. Whenever I don't know, but uh, <clears throat> I'm starting to feel cold coming on. So Tuesday, I think I'm about kind of sick. Uh, yeah, yeah. Anyways, thanks for watching. Goodbye.